Hey, let's talk about the different eras of Power Rangers. Remember the Zordon era? That was the early years of Power Rangers, starting with the original Mighty Morphin Power Rangers series. It aired from 1993 to 1996 and had Zordon, the mentor to the Rangers, guiding them in their fight against villains like Rita Repulsa and Lord Zed. It included seasons like Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, Power Rangers Zeo, Power Rangers Turbo, and Power Rangers in Space. The Zordon era had cool suits, unique Zords, and introduced new Ranger teams. After that came the post-Zordon era. It began with Power Rangers Lost Galaxy in 1999. This era moved away from the Zordon storyline and took the Rangers on space adventures, battling evil forces like the space pirate Divatox and the villainous Trakina. Seasons like Lost Galaxy, Lightspeed Rescue, Time Force, Wild Force, and Ninja Storm belonged to this era. Then we had the Disney era, which started in 2002 with Power Rangers Wild Force and lasted until 2009 with Power Rangers RPM. During this era, Disney took over the production, bringing some changes in storytelling and visuals. It gave us seasons like Mystic Force, Operation Overdrive, Jungle Fury, and RPM. The Disney era had diverse ranger teams, innovative Zord designs, and compelling character-driven stories. Next up was the Neo Saban era, which began in 2011 with Power Rangers Samurai and ended in 2018 with Power Rangers Super Ninja Steel. Saban Brands returned as the production company and mixed original footage with footage from the Super Sentai series. The Neo Saban era had a consistent visual style and storytelling approach, appealing to both new and longtime fans. Seasons like Samurai, Mega Force, Dino Charge, and Ninja Steel belong to this era. Lastly, we have the Hasbro era, which started in 2019 with Power Rangers Beast Morphers and is the current era as of my knowledge cutoff. Hasbro acquired the franchise and brought its own creative vision. The Hasbro era has a fresh direction while maintaining connections to previous seasons. We got Beast Morphers, Dino Fury, and there are more exciting seasons to come. This era brings new storytelling techniques, updated suit designs, and a renewed focus on fan engagement and expanding the brand. Each era of Power Rangers has its own special elements, from story themes to visuals, introducing new characters, zords, and villains. But no matter the era, Power Rangers always delivers dynamic action, teamwork, and themes of heroism that capture the imaginations of fans.